All right, so I've used the Marine Series hybrid spray coating on the entire exterior of the, uh, the GTX 300 here. Next step with this black plastic trim, all this trim is the plastic and rubber hydrate. It's going to give you the maximum protection for all of your plastic trim, I should say porous plastic trim. Um, I always like to shake everything up before I use it. Put a little bit on the foam applicator that comes in the kit. If you get a little bit of this on your CM Tech material or uh, your paint or gel coat, it is not going to hurt one bit. It will not hurt anything. This is a very high end polymer and water based formula. So there's no harsh solvents that are gonna cause a problem with anything you put it on. This will darken and protect. It is best to start using this stuff before you need it. That way the sun's beating this up instead of beating the actual trim up. So as you can see, it looks amazing. What I usually recommend as far as the plastic and rubber hydrate application is, once it's clean then clean and dry, then you'll apply the product. I like to take one of these black microfiber towels. After it's sat for a couple of minutes, I always recommend, especially the first time you put it on, you want to over apply very slightly. That way, uh, the penetrant that's in there will soak in and you can wipe the excess right off the top. there you go that's it you would go around the entire ski or boat or whatever you're working on and just apply it to all the plastic trim try it one more time on that speaker notice I got a little bit on the pad That's it. I applied it to the whole thing. Take my black microfiber towel. You can go right over that. Normally I'd wait a couple of minutes, but for the sake of this video, I'm gonna go ahead and just wipe off the excess. There you go. Good stuff.